12 things people think are forbidden in the Bible, but aren't. 1. Eating shellfish. The Bible does not prohibit the consumption of shellfish. Leviticus 11 names some impure animals, like pigs and insects, but shellfish are not explicitly named. The only seafood prohibited is everything in the waters that does not have fins and scales. Leviticus 11.10 In the New Testament, Jesus declares all foods clean. So many Christians view those dietary laws as outdated. 2. Alcohol The Bible allows drinking alcohol in moderation. It does condemn drunkenness and overindulgence. 3. Tattoos There's no clear prohibition against tattoos in the Bible. The cited verse addresses pagan mourning rituals. You shall not make any cuttings in your flesh for the dead, nor tattoo any marks on you. Leviticus 19.28 Many Christians and Jews see this rule as no longer binding. 4. Working on Sundays The Bible commands resting on the Sabbath, Saturday. Early Christians moved the rest day to Sunday, the day of Christ's resurrection. But this change is not explicitly stated in the Bible. 5. Eating pork. The dietary laws in Leviticus prohibit eating pork, but Christians see this law as obsolete in the New Testament. Jesus stated that all foods are clean. Paul encouraged not to judge food choices. Most Christians interpret this as allowing pork consumption. 6. Dancing. The Bible mentions positive examples of dance. Miriam danced after crossing the Red Sea. David danced mightily before the Lord. Psalms promote dance as worship and praise. However, one form of dance is condemned. In Galatians chapter 5 verses 19 to 21, Paul lists out works of the flesh that Christians should avoid. Included in this list is the Greek word komos. It is sometimes translated as revelries. This term means wild immoral parties. So lewd sensual dancing is prohibited. 7. Birth control. The Bible does not directly address contraceptives. Some interpret God's command to be fruitful and multiply as prohibiting birth control, but most Christians believe family planning is a personal choice. 8. Divorce. The Bible frowns upon divorce. However exceptions are made, the New Testament permits it if one spouse abandons or cheats on the other. 9. Interracial marriage. The Bible doesn't ban interracial marriage. The verses cited relate to specific situations, not a general ban. The Canaanite rule aimed to avoid pagan influences. The New Testament has no racial marriage restrictions. Galatians 3.28 states that all are one in Christ. This suggests race is irrelevant for believers. 10. Celebrating birthdays. The Bible neither praises nor criticizes birthdays. Certain Christians skip birthdays, believing they stem from paganism. However, the Bible does not forbid celebrating them. 11. Playing games and sports. The scriptures do not ban recreation and games if done in moderation. The Bible stresses self-control and avoiding idleness, but it does not condemn all games, sports, or fun. 12. Lending money with interest. The scripture does not forbid all lending with interest. Prohibitions were against charging interest to poor Israelites but interest on business loans was permitted 